Hi, this is Xenia from EcoSense, and this is EcoCube unboxing video. Let's get started. Today, we'll be looking at intelligent radon detector EcoCube from EcoSense. And the first thing you see once you open is EcoCube user guide. EcoCube, power cable, and power adapter. Here you can see the LED light. It will show you the current status of EcoCube. Now at the bottom of EcoCube, you'll see the QR code, which you'll need to scan to activate the device to add new device to your phone. You'll see the reset button. You'll see power port. So you plug it in smaller end of power cable here. All right, so once you plug it in, the first thing you'll see is flashing orange, means it's in setup mode and waiting to connect to a Wi-Fi network. All right, so we completed the step one. Step two is to download and open the EcoCube app. And to create an account, you'll need to put your email, password, and confirm your password. Now again, login. EcoCube would like to access your camera and we have to click OK because we need to scan the QR code at the bottom. EcoCube would like to use Bluetooth, scan EcoCube device and connect to EcoCube. So what you'll do is you flip the EcoCube, you'll see the QR code and once you scanned it, you'll put the device name and device location Scanning Wi-Fi, put in password for my Wi-Fi. Your EcoCube is successfully connected and you can see right away that the LED light from blinking yellow turned to green. So now I begin my radon monitoring. And let's take a quick look at the app. As yeah, so here you can see the name EcoCube Home. This is what I set up. Here we can see the color indication and more information you can find here when you click eye icon. Green means no action required, yellow consider fixing home, and red recommended fixing home. And again, this is all in picocures per liter, which is common for the United States. And then for example, if you are in Canada or you are in Europe, then you would switch here device setting device configuration and you can switch to becquerels per cubic meter here is the ecosense portal so you can find useful articles here like blog posts social media posts podcasts and here you will actually see your rate and level historical chart, meaning it will show me the level and how it's changing during the day. I can choose it by week, by month, or even annually. That was the easy setup that I've done just in few minutes.